So if you just watched my last video, you just saw me unbox and do my first impression of Gladiator Beard Company. Well, today's date is Sunday, February 17th, 2019, and I'm here to give you my review of Gladiator Beard Company. Really damn good. That's not going to be my whole review, but I'm going to say damn good products. $17.99 for a beard oil, $19.99 for a beard balm. Just under $40 if you have shipping with Amazon or you have the Prime, you'll get it in two days. And I think that's the only place they're selling these right now is on Amazon. So I will link exactly where they are, but I don't think they have them available on another website or anything as of the view as of this video. If they do, I will definitely add it in the description for the future. Gladiator Beer Company. I'm impressed. I'm dead serious. Two ounce beard oil, very nice packaging, very, it's very slick labels, I will say. And the ingredients in here, virgin argan oil, pure jojoba oil, vitamin E oil, sweet almond oil, apricot kernel oil, avocado oil, pumpkin seed oil, hemp seed oil, grape seed oil, scented with premium grade essential oils. So you got nine carrier oils in here. For $17.99 for a two ounce beard oil, don't really think there's any downfall. It's it's in the happy medium of the market average. And the dropper, you get about half of a dropper full, which is okay. I'm not, I'm not going to knock that. This scent is incredible. It is, it is, it's, it's two different scents for me. When you smell it out of the bottle, you get like a barbershop-esque scent but when I put it in my hand, warm it up, and put it in my beard, I get a Bay Rum-esque to it as well. This, is, to me, is like two different types of scents. It's like a Bay Rum, a traditional Bay Rum, and a barbershop on top of it. That's the two things that I get from this, and I absolutely love it. This was a one-time application for me. However, I will say this. Here lately, and it's probably, probably because of the weather changing and everything, I've had to use Bay Rum or Barbershop scents multiple times during the day. And I think it's because that my beard is just soaking it in because of the elements and stuff. I'm not blaming it on the product, but it's just the, these two scents here lately and on other companies as well, they're, my beard is soaking them in faster. So I did apply these twice for safety purposes. I didn't have to. But I did it also because I absolutely love this smell. It is one of the best scents I've smelled in quite a while. I like it. It's, I'd say, medium thickness. Yeah, definitely a medium thick oil. Give you a close up there. A little bit of a yellow tint to it. Yeah, definitely a medium thickness. It's good. I like this. Two thumbs up for this beard oil all day long. The Beard Balm is a 2.6 ounce container. So you're getting a little bit more for 20 bucks. Again, that's in that market average. So you can't go wrong with that. This is what impresses me the most. No stickers. There are no stickers on this tin. Everything you see has been printed on it. This company went pretty far and beyond for presentation and it's awesome. Uh, the, the presentation is awesome, but the but the product itself inside, screw off container, of course. Oh, mm. I think there are some. Let me give you the ingredients here: shea butter, beeswax, argan, jojoba, vitamin E, sweet almond, apricot kernel, avocado, pumpkin seed, grape seed, hemp seed. Those are the oils and the butters and waxes that are in here. Now, on here, it tells me. Also, frankincense, myrrh, bergamot, cocoa, peppermint, lavender, vanilla, patchouli, and orange. If that is the essential oils that they put in all of this to get this actual smell, I'm impressed. And I'm not saying that they didn't, but this is impressive. Like I said, I get from this a creamier scent than compared to the beer oil. I actually think that I like this beer oil, beer balm better than the scent of the oil. 
I just get like a barber shop and a clean bay rum in in this. It's it's really amazing. <laughs> I'm telling you. You can see this is super duper creamy. Just watch. Like I don't even want to waste it. Like I really don't. It's just it's so good. It's a very, very creamy beard ball. Probably one of the smoothest that I have checked out in a long time. It's a light hold, I will say. It's definitely a light, little bit of a medium. It's, de it's definitely on the stronger side of a light side than it is a medium side for me. Went right into the beard. I actually have been using this as a nighttime aid as well. Not necessarily as like a balm for hold, but it's, I'm basically using it for a butter. And I absolutely love this. Um, two thumbs up for this beard balm right here. Now, for the pricing, like I said, it's $40 roughly for this combo here. Is it worth the money? You're damn right. Gladiator Beer Company has impressed me 100%. So we went over the consistency. The delivery methods is, of course, the typical standard dropper and their screw-off tin. The ingredients are great. You got nine carrier oils in here. And the scent profile, which I think is amazing. The price is right on. Do I recommend these to you guys? Absolutely. 100, 1 million percent. Today, the Gladiator Beer Company is getting a two thumbs up and a five star Beer Times with Scott rating today. Gladiator Beard has impressed me 100 percent. I thought about this because someone asked me, you know, on a fellow reviewer, if... Um, you know, they're, they're looking for them to try to, to bring something else out, a new scent or something. I'll be dead honest. I would I, I would be awesome if they did. But on the other side, I think it would be really cool if they just stuck to this only. Because this would be like their thing. And I think it's really, really awesome. I, I So I really can't say I would like to see them make something else. Because I absolutely love these two products. I really, really do. And the one thing that I, I didn't talk about, which I haven't figured out what this is yet, and they have something they trademarked. It's called the Beard Shield Formula. I haven't really looked into what that is yet, but if anybody knows what that is, please comment below because I honestly don't know what that is. It's something that they've trademarked, and this is the Icon Scent. I just now noticed that. That's what they call this, the Icon Scent. And they're based out of Colorado. So that's a couple good companies that I've been checking out from Colorado here lately. So, again, Gladiator Beer Company. Two thumbs up, five-star beer times with Scott rating today. And where am I going to put these in my collection? Right there. They're going on the top shelf because this is something that I'm going to be using pretty much nightly now. I really, really enjoy both these products. They're both going on my top shelf. So Gladiator Beard. Thank you very much for giving me the opportunity. I greatly appreciate it. And I can't really say that I would love to see you guys make something new. I kind of want you to, but then again, I don't because I love this. I, this is one of the best beer balms I have used ever. And I do recommend all of you guys to give this oil and this balm a try. Again, I know they're on Amazon, so I'll link them in the description box of where you can purchase them. So, And I don't have a discount code for these, unfortunately. And that's awesome. I, it's awesome that I don't have one because I do honestly think these are worth every penny that they are selling them for. So go check out Gladiator Beard. They're on Instagram as well, and I'll link that in the description. And as always, thank you very much for your constant support. Keep on bearding, everybody. Please subscribe to my little dude up here. And... We'll have some giveaways and all that good stuff coming up in the future. Also, click on one of these two videos if you want to watch some more content. And click the notification bell so you can see everything first. Thanks again for watching. See you soon.